Hey traders, let's have a look at some lessons that we can learn from Bitcoin. Let's get straight into it. Do not place a trade based on what you're seeing in this video today because trading is risky and it can cause substantial financial loss. There are so many areas you need to become good at to become a good trader. Emotional mastery, chart reading, trading systems, money and trade management. So this video is just educational only to help you become a much better trader. Hey traders, as you know that some of the biggest things that makes you a successful trader is really learning the art of trade management and really good money management techniques. I've just recorded the video walking through all the steps that's really going to help you. So click on that, click on the box above that says trade and money management and to get access to this video right now. All right, hey traders, I want to do this quick video for you because I want to share some things with you that we all can learn. Uh, as a trader from Bitcoin and you can look at and I just want to share with you what I see Basically what's been happening uh, for quite some time. So I've just put up a line chart here of Bitcoin Let me actually bring this up right up here. This is the daily chart of Bitcoin what we're looking at right now mm -hmm. so the daily chart of Bitcoin and the thing is uh, what you what you can see happens with Bitcoin is is You can see that it, it goes through these cycles. It's, it's done it a couple of times now where you can see how that when it has when it, when it when it breaks past an area of resistance for a while, it has a big blast off. You can see a big blast off, and then it goes through a cycle again. And you can see here it goes through like a bit of a what we call a triangle pattern. You can see here, and then we have a big blast off, and then we have a big smackdown. You can see here blast off and smackdown, and then we went through a bit of a resistance through here, blast off, blast off, smackdown, slowly crawled up broke past this area of resistance and then blast back off and then it came straight back down so you can see this is overall stair stepping up continue to stair step up but as you can see this is the this is the rhythm that bitcoin is going through and uh and i did a video a while ago saying don't buy bitcoin up here and all i was saying was i wasn't i wasn't saying don't buy bitcoin at all i was just saying that be smart about the way you, where you get in as a trader and the reason why I did that video, and I didn't do one up here because I'm just like, it's the exact same thing as over here, is I want you guys to uh, think about this here. One of my earliest mentors, millionaire trader, he once said, if the move has already gone, it's too late to get in. If the move is already gone, it's too late to get in. So that simply means is that if you see a parabolic move, uh, like that in Bitcoin and you're thinking of getting in up here or here or here it's too late to get in you've missed the boat what you want to be doing is you want to be getting in before before the takeoff and the reason why is because we're trying to have a small risk small risk reward so for example you get in on the breakout have a stop just by the breakout and enjoy the ride up uh, what a lot of traders do is they wait. They wait for confirmation. The, and what I'm talking about that is that they say, okay, I, I, I need to see this market blast off to the high side. Absolutely just take off. Just really, really take off. And uh, and once it goes, then I'm going to get in. It's like a, a, a lot of people, and, and this is the reason why it's hard for uh, us humans, or most humans, to become good trader, most of us uh, to, to become good traders because what they uh, what most people do is they wait for confirmation. Most people are followers. You got the followers and you got the leaders. The leaders say, you know what, this is breaking out now. I'm getting in. Followers they get in as the market's going up and then they get they get, they get sort of hemmed. They wait for they they want to say, okay, look, the market's going up now. I'm going to get in because they think it's going to keep going up. And the markets don't work like that. The market stair step like this. As you guys know, right? You can see how that's how the market works. It it has a run up and a stair steps. It runs up and a stair steps. Runs up and a stair steps. We have a big run up and we have a stair step. You know, and it's the same thing here as well too. So, so within that, guys, the lessons we can learn from Bitcoin is one: you can see it has a repetitive pattern. So you know, we may actually experience something over the next couple of months. We may get some more stair stepping back up again, and we may break past and we may see two thousand or three thousand Bitcoin. Um. But the thing is I want to say guys is that when you're trading it's important to get in on the breakout not when it's just absolutely just exploded up. So ask yourself before you get in whether the market's gone up a lot or down a lot or whether you're looking for a bullish or bearish trade. Ask yourself 
has the market already moved significantly in my direction that I'm looking to get into? So if you're looking to buy any stock or do any trade, ask yourself, has the market already moved significantly in my direction? And if the answer is yes, the move is already gone. It's too late to get in. You need to wait for a nice new pattern. Okay, guys? So whether that's down or whether that's up, always get in be always get in on the breakout not after it explodes up this is the wrong time to get in why because how the markets work is that the market will go up and it's you and you know that you know it's due for a pullback you don't know when the pullback is going to happen but you know it is due for a pullback and most people are getting in up here because they they, they think it's going to kick out forever and then it gets pulled back and then they say the market burnt me it's like you have to be better about your trading decisions when you're moving forward and this is a lesson you can learn from Bitcoin as well. Hey, thanks for watching. If you'd like to get more free education about trading, then click on the box that says free trading course. This is a free trading course. It goes for around 12 hours long. It's about 12 videos long. It covers everything from chart reading, mindset, trading systems, money management, trade management, everything you need to get yourself ahead in the markets. And if you'd like to get my help personally, then click on the box that says get John's help and you'll be able to see how you can get my help personally. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on the video. And remember, success can be yours if you go claim it. So step up, take massive action, and face your fears today.